Hello again everyone, this is Gina from Vintage Digs and I wanted to shoot a quick preview video for tonight's sale for you and show you a few of the items that I will be showing so that you can make a decision on whether you see anything in here, any beautiful little item that you might be interested in beforehand. Now there may be a few more things I've added to it that I didn't have room for so just know that going in, this may not be everything, but I'm going to get through as much of this as I possibly can tonight. So let's get started. So over here I have some milk glass, oops, my finger's in the way. Some milk glass, uh, a little bit of art glass there, a nice pottery duck, I think that's American Bisque, I'll have to look and see. A cute little cigarette um, ashtray, stacking ashtray holder. Um, I believe that's, I forgot who made that, I think that's Lefton. It is a Lefton piece. I've got this amazing brass, all brass inkwell. It does have the pots in it, the ceramic pots. Really nice old piece. A little piece of art glass there. Some Murano, which I've shown once before. All of this stuff is kind of last chance. I'm about to put all this stuff in my eBay or at the antique mall site. I want to show you guys so you can see if there's anything you're interested in. Uh, there's a little tea, it's like a uh, porcelain tea strainer there, highly decorated. I am going to bring in my perfume bottles tonight, in case anyone's interested, the Dresden perfume. Um, no going in, they are going to be a little more spendy than, you know, maybe what you're used to, but I'm going to offer them up if anybody's interested. So just know that uh, for tonight's sale, I will be having that, and I'm going to have a couple other, you know, higher end pieces, so if you're interested, make sure you join us. Um, I do have this hand-woven Native American basket. It is really cool. Uh, I have a couple marionettes, as you see, puppets. I've got some older books over here. I got this guy. He's kind of cool. He is not. Um, he is not any kind of pottery. He's actually one of those hard plastics. And I think he was supposed to be a bank. I call him Old Salty. I think he was supposed to be a bank, but he doesn't have a cutout that I could find anywhere. He's just really a cool piece, made it look like old wood, you know? A beautiful Victorian Bristol uh, glass vase there. These are amazing if you've never gotten one of these. I love Bristol glass. We got uh, the set of four for the seasons, uh, Courier and Ives wall hanging plates. Some more art glass there, some cute little pottery fishes there little tea bag holder, a really nice piece of old majolica back there, uh, some Delphite glass, I believe it's Fire King, and then I am going to be offering as well tonight this old, um, it's the Chariot Race, and it is an older European piece, I believe it was out of Italy, it is sterling with the cameo, the hand carved shell design, and it's and it's supposed to show uh, the scenes from a, sh a chariot race. It's very, <laughs> you know, god and goddess kind of thing. Cat would love it. And then I do have some old story about cameo earrings that are also set in sterling. My dogs are going crazy and they just ignore them. Um, I do have a really nice crystal um, perfume bottle there that I'm going to be showing. And then I come over here and a nice old mustache mug. It says your father's mustache on it. It's got the rim. A couple of really nice old bells. And then these two pieces here are actually, or actually these three pieces right here are actually all Hager. So you have the ashtray and then these two like serving dishes. Those are all Hager pieces. So, just to give you a general overview of some of the stuff you're going to be seeing tonight, like I said, I'm probably going to throw a few more pieces in here and there, depending on what people like. I do have some more things ready in case people are liking certain things over other things, so make sure you join us, because you never know what me and Kat might pull out and show you, you know? That sounded horrible, but you know what I mean. <laughs> we always have something that we hope will interest everyone in the room. Like I said, I'm gonna keep this short and sweet. I just wanted to give you a really quick view of the things I've got set out so far. 
and I may pull out a few more jewelry pieces depending on my mood by then. So I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a rainy day, but that's all right. You gotta have the rain every once in a while. At least it'll cool it off some, right? So hopefully I'll see you tonight. It's gonna be on Calypso Antiques, which is Kat's channel. So make sure you pop over there. It is at, I believe, 8.30. I believe that's right. <laughs> I have trouble remembering sometimes, but I'm pretty sure it's 8 or 8.30, but I'm leaning towards 8.30. I should have known that before I came on here. Sorry about that. But it's going to be on her channel, Calypso Antiques. And it's going to be a great live sale. We have lots of fun. And I have something new to show you that my daughter has came come up with for us. So make sure you pop in and join us for that as well. Because I want to do a, kind of an unveiling, if you will. Oh, and I also forgot, I'm going to be doing a little giveaway tonight. So you got to be there to win. So make sure you come and hang out with us for a little while. Because I'm going to do a little giveaway. Something I think you all will like. So have a great day, guys. And hopefully I'll see you tonight in the chat. Until then, put a smile on that face. Share it with everybody around you. Put love in your heart. And it always works out in the end. Hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. See you very soon. Bye for now.